everyone. How's everyone doing? Hope everyone's having a fantastic morning, afternoon, or evening, depending on where you are. Hey, Seishi, how you doing? Hope you're having a good one, whether it be at work or otherwise. Uh, yeah. I think I've had a weird day today. Hoi hoi, yeah, hoi hoi. I've kind of had a weird day because, like, I don't have work tomorrow, but I keep on not believing it. <laughs> so... Like, I have, like, a like a dentist appointment tomorrow, so I just took the whole fucking day off. But I keep on, like, thinking I'm still going to work tomorrow, even though I'm, like, I'm not. And everything. So it's just, like, a weird, weird feeling right now. Because it's, like, I, I'm usually really excited to not work. But here here we are. I'm still, like, think in that zone of, hey, I'm, I'm going to work when I'm not. But. So, uh, there's a reason why we're doing Final Fantasy XIV today. Because you, cause like, yesterday I was like, oh yeah, I'm gonna take a break today because I did the code realizing on Tuesday, and then tomorrow I'm gonna probably do like Dragon Age or something. Only that did that's not happening today, because you know what happened last night? I lost at a jump puzzle in Final Fantasy XIV. So you know what the plan is today? I am going to do a jump puzzle in the video game Final Fantasy XIV. So as a background, um. In the hit, critically acclaimed MMORPG Final Fantasy XIV, uh, there's jump puzzles, and they're very frustrating. Like, the game was obviously not meant for jump puzzles or platforming, because, like, the hit box for everything in the game is very wonky, and you can get knocked off by anything, and also, like, hit boxes aren't usually truthful, so you have to, like, kind of plan around it when you're jumping around on stuff in Final Fantasy. But there are a couple major jump puzzles in the game that aren't, like, required for anything, but I like doing them and they make me angry. So, here's the plan today. I am just gonna have a chill time, um, just doing this jump puzzle thing. Um, it is with the new, um, it's with the new summer event. So there's a summer event going on and there's, like... It's basically Ninja Warrior, um, and I'll show you what exactly I'm talking about once we get a little closer to it, um, but there's a jump puzzle, and I want to do it, and I'm, I will not rest until I do it. I, I did the same thing, um, in the expansion Stormblood, there's, there's, uh, a new city called Kugane in that expansion, and it has the hardest jump puzzle in the entire game. Uh, where you climb Kugane Tower, which is a very, very, very long jump puzzle that you have to do to get two sightseeing points. And it, I think it took me, like, like a solid week of, like, playing the game, like, in the evenings after work. Just, like, logging in, getting as far as I can in Kugane Tower, and then logging out, and then falling off, probably, <laughs> then doing it all over again the next night. And, and, um, so... But it was like the one thing that gripped me the whole time. Like I delayed playing Shadowbringers for it. I was like, "There's a there's a fucking jump puzzle here, and I'm going to get it before I even move on with the main quest. I am doing this before I go to Shadowbringers, <laughs> and I sure did." Um, but um, I actually had to climb Kugani Tower twice though, because um, I said there's two sightseeing points that are tied to the tower. And so one of them is like at the top. So like once you climb Kugani Tower, defeat it, you get a sightseeing point. But there's also a sightseeing point that can only be gotten by jumping at a certain angle off of Kugani Tower. And I didn't know that before jumping down my first time. And then I learned, oh, there's another point that you can only get if you climb Kugani Tower and sprint off of it in this one area. And I was like, fuck. <laughs> So I did it again. That was another week, and then I finally climbed it again, jumped off the, the right angle, and then did it. But hopefully I won't. <laughs> hopefully I won't have the experience here because this is just like a fun thing. Um, which I don't even know what the reward for this is, other than like bragging rights. But I don't care. I want to do it. So that's what we're gonna do. Even if it's just bragging rights, that's what we're gonna do. So get ready, guys. I even got some tea with me. This is rare. I'm having some uh, later evening tea. It's like some, uh, like, I think it's like a very light black tea. Um, 
It's like chocolatey. It's it's weird. I usually don't, I usually don't like chocolate in my tea, but I got like this um fandom. It was not not an not a fandom blend. It was like an official tea thing that they did in Japan for an anime I like. So I of course uh, being a rational person, I special ordered um a few of these blends for myself, and they're very very good. Um, there's only one that I really didn't like that I'm just gonna like pawn off to my friends, but. Th this one I really liked, and it was my last one. So I figured I would say I would use my last bag of special anime tea for tonight to like soothe me through the process of jumping around. But anyway, let's get into it. So, bop bop bop. Here we are. <laughs> yeah. Um. This is my main. I usually don't. Um. Usually don't play on my main. I usually just play on my uh, near alt. But this is, this is what I'm doing it on. I don't want to do it. I want to do it on my main. So, uh, if anyone wants to join me in the jump puzzle, like, if anyone kind of wants to see me try and fail all the time, then you're welcome to. Uh, it's in Leviathan. Like, anyone can come in and just observe. Because, like, everyone's doing this right now. It's a fun thing. But I already did the summer event, so I already have her in her cute little uh, summer glam. It's going to be really fun. So, anyway, let's, let's get started. So... You might be wondering, what's this jump puzzle you're talking about? It's fucking Ninja Warrior, so... Let's do some Ninja Warrior first and get to the part what I'm talking about, so... So there's like a little bomb area that you can go through. Eh. Alright. The bombs knock you up knock you pretty much off of it, so I'd, I'm trying to avoid them. Ah! Okay. Come on, go off. There we go. Ah! Alright, we made it. So that's the first part. And you might be thinking, oh shit, jump puzzle. Is this it? Yeah, so let's... Let's just go up. This is pretty... Pretty standard, not anything you'd see outside the gold saucer. And pop. See exactly what I'm talking about with the um, collision here. I'm just floating in midair. So is uh, my minion. My minion's still standing. <laughs> so this is kind of what we're working with. Pop. Uh, pop. 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 And you can jump here. So. Now you're seeing people are jumping it this way. Uh oh. And this is what we're working with today. <laughs> okay, so I need to aim here. Go. And this is the actual where the fun begins. So let's go. Okay. This part's like pretty simple enough. But I got really high and I fell off last night, which is why I'm like, we're doing this today. <laughs> there is no question about this. I get intense when it comes to my Final Fantasy XIV jump puzzles. Which is stupid because it is what it is. Defeat the jumps. Hey, Tenten, how you doing? Hope you're having a fa fantastic one. Ah! Okay. It's fine. That's that's not what made me mad last night. <laughs> Technically, I'm just gonna go up the bomb route. At least I'm moving. But Tenta, did you do the event yet? Did you get your cute little um, summer outfit for Sun? Not yet. Ah, it's so cute though. Okay. Uh, oh, oh, I ran right past it. It's gonna get on when Ren wants to add us. Yeah, yeah. I might get on. Um, I don't know when Ren's gonna get on next. Cause when I, cause like, we're in different time zones, so. Uh, I guess fine. 
Because I think usually when I'm I'm like online is when like Ren's asleep or something or should be asleep. <laughs> we'll figure it out though. I would like to be Ren's friend. That's my ma. That's my mama. I would like to be my mama's friend. Okay, come on. Let's go. You know what? I can't make it if I just jump from here, but what if I do this? Ah! Shit, I can- that's, that's good. Now I have to wait for the, my sprint to go on. Go off, I mean. Sprinting helps you, like, make big gaps, but also... It, it really screws up my regular jump side to wait. It'll help for a little bit. There we go. My partner is playing Stray. <laughs> like I got Stray. I haven't. I haven't played much of it yet. I see we're doing the real end game content yet. Yeah. No, real end game content is Kagane Tower. That this is just as aggravating. <laughs> How you doing, Metatars? How you doing? I hope I'm having a fantastic one. And I hope. I hope you're recovering from whatever you're recovering from. Yep. Mm. I'm fine. Nothing happened, guys. It's fine. <laughs> we're we're chill time here. I have my tea. We're we're gonna get through this. Again. I'm I have not reached the part that may be mad yet. This is just the stuff that we have to get through before I get to the part that made me mad. Ah, okay. This why this can't be from what's prob co bo bovid povid. <laughs> Eating is like munching on a rock of salt. No! Ah, I hope I hope whatever it is, if even if it's a uh, bovid or covid, it it clears up soon. I missed that. I I knew as soon as I jumped out, like I'm not getting that. It's fine. my sprint back. I'm just gonna do that. There we go. That's easy. I'm just gonna sit here for a little bit. Is my tea cold down yet? No, it is not. Oof. I'm using my tea in my favorite mug. It is literally just written on it word for word the coffee scene from Tales of Symphonia. And it is my favorite shit ever. I almost didn't make that. I was almost a little dumbass. <laughs> okay. Actually, like... Hmm. There is one trick I like doing, but I'm not... I don't want to get out of my beach tire. No! It's fine. <laughs> We're still not there yet. But one cool thing they- one thing I figured out is that if you wear like- if you're- if you're a female Warrior Blight, specifically, you can use any dress or long skirt 
thing could help you like gauge um like how far you can go off a platform without falling off like as long as the um skirt is still touching the what you can see to be the end of the platform you can you can reach it no problem you can stand there safely It's kind of like a fun visual trick if you're having issues like judging wh where the hitboxes are on all these platforms for jump puzzles. I don't want to get out of this gland though. Actually, let me show you guys. But never mind. I can't. I can't apply my glams here. Unless, unless. Nah. Nope. 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 I'm trying to see if I had like another set that had a different glam, but no. Is is fine though. Uh, you guys can't see the, the Final Fantasy chat, but there's so many uh, free company advertisements right now because everyone knows that we're all here. Uh, I don't need a wall jump for that. Nah. Okay. Mm. There we go. Alright. Cool. We're... The classic plus, plus join free company. So this is technically supposed to be the uh, the second level, the second layer. Where you're supposed to be safe from falling, but y you're not. Y you're really not. <laughs> Dang it. Okay, so I'll just jump that. There we go. And actually with this one, I can just fall off. I don't have to jump actually. Yep. I just run off. And I can get on this fine. Let's go. Ah! Ah, Scully! <laughs> Come to steal your computer chips. Hey, how you doing? Hope you're having a fantastic one. Welcome in. How you doing, Scully? I think I can run off of this one too. Ah, nope. Nope. <laughs> Thank you for the resub, by the way. I don't remember if I said that, but I I'm in I'm in focus mode right now. <laughs> Love you, how are you? I'm I'm doing good. Um I had a I had a weird day. Just just weird. Like not bad, just weird. Um just cause like I like I don't have to work tomorrow and I just for some reason, I just can't get in my head to like, oh, you're not working tomorrow. You are you have a dentist appointment. But my head just can't understand that, can't comprehend it. So that's kind of the state of mind I'm in today. But I'm doing good now. Uh, I'm just trying to calmly climb up this mountain. This ninja warrior mountain. I keep, keep being careful about that, but it's a long jump, so I, have to, I don't have to be careful. I can just go. Oh, I'm not. I'm jumping off too early. That's what. I just did it too. Hope we have a level rest pool today tomorrow. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, I was. Uh, I was supposed to um, have my appointment like really early in the morning. That that this might also be throwing me off. It was supposed to be like at eleven or something. I have to drive a while to get to it because you know can't get to it quickly but um but now like now it's only at three so i can actually sleep in but i'm gonna feel weird about it it's just it's just so weird oh yeah <laughs> 
Oh my god. You got an Alec this time, 1010. Okay, so I I don't remember. I think it's here that I can walk off on. Oh, wait. Wait. It's here. Bop. There we go. You don't have to you don't have to jump, just walk, just walk. It's very, way safer. Wow. <laughs> oh, you got the black wall one! Scully! Gotta sleep until you have 30 minutes until you have an appointment. I mean, it takes like... Like, I have to drive like an hour to get there. <laughs> so, uh, an hour, hour, a half hour before I leave, at least. So sleep until 1.30. Got it. <laughs> you got Blackwall. I mean, you sure did in all all kinds of words that you could use to describe it. God. What choice are you going to make when you actually get him in uh, Inquisition? Like, what, what are you going to do? I'm curious. Don't tell me if you plan on streaming it, but I will wait until then, but... If you're not streaming it, I would like to know <laughs> what you intend for that man. If you're if you're not making him suffer in my playthrough specifically. If you want him to suffer in general, that like power to you. <laughs> there we go. No! I overshot that really bad. Oh. <laughs> um, I almost jumped right off the fucking thing. Okay. Bop. I haven't fully thought it just I just know it was very unme decision to took that night. Usually try to make characters happy. Ah, okay. I think there's like I think there's another option you get if you romance them. I don't remember. I don't remember off the top of my head, but I believe there's you get like a, another option if you romance them. And that's all I'm gonna say. But I remember something like different popping up. Dang it. Yeah, usually I'm very nice in my playthroughs, except for Solus. I don't like him, but I try to be nice. But of course, I shall romance. You want that beard, and you shall get it. But I do really like, um, I do really like Black Ball's romance for the drama of it all. Like, as you see, it's going to be full of drama. Just by his character arc alone, it is meant for drama. But it, like, um, I romanced Blackwall in my third playthrough. And even though I, like, had seen his events, like, two times already, I was still just like, <gasps> when everything went down, just like, <gasps> no, he betrayed me. <laughs> So it, I, th I think it's good romance. I know Ten Ten. Uh, I think, I think for Blackwall, if um, Ten Ten was in a room full of his least favorite characters in existence and only had two bullets, um, he shoot Blackwall twice. Based on what I've seen, it's either him or uh, Velcro uh, that have that hatred. A am I right, <laughs> Ten Ten? <laughs> <laughs> is that your opinion on Blackwall? Is that you'd shoot him twice in a room full of your least favorite characters? <laughs> or would you shoot Anders twice? Th that's that's your that, that's uh that's a great question there. Look, sometimes you just <laughs> I don't know. You just what? No, I'm... Oh, I almost fucked up there. There's so many characters here that it's really hard to... really... set up jumps sometimes. Because you just can't see my own character. Because my, my character's so fucking short. That's the issue. Will I make her taller? Absolutely not. 
But still, that's the issue at hand. <laughs> I can barely see her. Because, like, I don't like jumping towards these. I don't want to... Because I could just fall off here. And, like, it's just, like, a specific angle I have to go at it to not have to jump. Because I don't, I don't want to jump. To that one, at least. There we go. All right, cool, cool, cool. Got it. Anytime I have any opportunity to like not jump. Okay, this This is the jump that I really fucked up last night. <laughs> so let, let me just take a calm calming sip of tea first. Never mind, it's too hot still. Never mind. That wasn't calming at all. Okay. <gasps> okay. We got it. Okay. <clears throat> okay, that's fine. <clears throat> it's fine. It's fine. I have to do that jump again. It's fine. It's fine. I'm, I'm not bothered at all. I'm not bothered at all. Huh? <laughs> I'm not mad at all, though, guys. I'm I'm not mad. I'm not mad. My tea's still very hot. All right, round two. If I can get on this on this uh, platform, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. No. <clears throat> okay. I'm a little mad now. <laughs> I'm playing it up a little bit, but I don't like it when I jump off that from that high. That was also me being a dumbass. It's fine. Alright, let's go. Now, did a Reaper just fucking just skip all that? Oh, bye. Anyway, let's go. Let's go. I wasted a sprint. That's fine. feeling what we're gonna be here all stream I, I was originally just be, gonna be like hey well if I do this early we'll do fate grinding but eh. I think I'll be at this for a while <laughs> just because every time you fail you have to do all this again which kind of sucks I have sprint again though. That's something. Ah, I keep overshooting that. That's why. Well, Sonic Speed time. But I'm having a weird day. It was actually like pretty chill. It's just weird as in like I can't, I don't know calendars anymore. Doing a surprising amount of like planning and stuff. I've been messing around in some different programs. But it's been fun. It's always nice to like do other things because usually like I'm I'm waiting for my sprint to go up, but I'm usually like more of a writer person, so I do a lot of writing. But you know, lately for VTubing, I've been doing a lot of like graphic design stuff, like very very lightly using the term graphic design. But I've been doing like some more 
like fun stuff like making the advertisements and stuff but uh i've been working on different programs now and it's like wow i don't have to completely restrict my writing to just like traditionally written work now so that's cool it's great for the for the any creative really to kind of toy around with stuff because otherwise you just get to stagnate it's, it, that really sucks when you just stagnate at everything because it's just like whenever everything gets to be like very extremely routine and very very like I don't know dry I guess then it really starts affecting your creative work So yeah, it's it's been nice. I've been kind of in a slump recently, like for writing specifically, not for not for streaming because I've been enjoying this. But I don't even know how you'd like stagnate creatively because they're just like, oh, well, my overlay, I need to change it, but I can't figure out how that that kind of thing. Which speaking of, I <laughs> I actually am in that predicament. <laughs> I'm gonna change up my background somehow. I don't know. I don't know how. What direction I should really go with it? It just you're just kind of like sitting there, like I know I want it to change, but I don't know how. They just kind of sit there and stare at it for a while until your brain unsticks itself. Kind of like sometimes when you're writing and you're just like, I have this really cool idea and I really want to write it, but I do not know how which direction to approach it in. Um, like, there's a lot of times when I like have this really cool idea and I'm like, I really want to work on this, but my brain will not let me because I can't decide which angle to go about this. Because uh, writing has a lot of different like ways to approach things, so. It, well, it's, same, it's a similar thing with art for art in general where you have an idea in your head and you're not sure what angle you want to go or the, where you want to like what would be the way, best way to convey this idea that I have and for writing it's mainly like should it be in first person second person third person that there's like kind of the high level stuff but there's also like stuff like timing like you have the story in your head and you and sometimes it's like good to tell it chronologically and sometimes it's good to like do it um, in a little more like mixed up style like one thing I, I really enjoy doing is like mixing up timelines so like two concurrent um, plots are happening at the same time that interweave with each other that's why I like doing but sometimes it doesn't work and usually if it doesn't, doesn't work with that I'm like well what do I do now I can't make two interweaving plots what do I do now ah and that's what literally happens in real life when I get to that point. I just uh, fail at a jump puzzle. <laughs> um, but I've been having like a lot of that too recently, where it's just like I have the all these ideas, but I just can't. Every time I'm thinking of, every time I think of a way for me to potentially like convey this little thing I want to write, it's like it doesn't fit. Like. It could fit, like there's nothing wrong with it, but also I know it could do better. That's the thing. And your brain won't tell you how you could do it better until, like, I don't know, it decides to unstick itself. I don't know why I'm talking about this while I'm doing a very frustrating jump puzzle, but that does... I'm just talking about creative shit, like, now, I guess. That's- that's what hap- this is what happening. Yeah, <laughs> nod, 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 nod. Yeah, I just want to wait for my sprint to go up. I don't even know what's up here. You can't use your mount in this area. Um, as soon as you enter the Ninja Warrior course, it restricts you, so you can't even, like, go spy on it or anything. You have to like you have to physically go up there in order for you to see it. 
Which is smart. It makes you say you want to get it, but the Ninja Warrior course is funny. It is. It's so good, though. Wait, that that person wasn't sprinting. Eh. I'm just gonna be safe. I'm gonna do the sprint there. Just wait here. I was not expecting an Ninja Warrior course for uh, for this. I was the first because they mentioned that this was like done before, but like a little dressed down, like no bombs or anything, but. Like, how long ago was that? Because I don't think they did the Ninja Warrior course since I've been playing. I think it's a really cute idea. Yeah! Oh. Okay. Okay, you should be. <laughs> I think, like, the last few summer events that I've seen are all like the fate based ones where like you're fighting a giant bomb or something. I can't remember the other ones but those are the ones I remember like I think my first one was like oh you do the fate and you fight a giant bomb with a bunch of people and you get stuff from it. Then like I know the last year's one was a similar one except it was like ice themed. I'm probably forgetting one because I Ah, oh, when did I start playing this game? <laughs> I don't I don't remember, but that might have been the only two that I've seen so far. All in this, too. I don't even remember what, how long it's been since Ten Ten and Vel got me were my, basically my Final Fantasy drug dealers. Ah, my tea is perfect temperature. I'm gonna drink all of this. Okay. Which, uh, speaking of uh, Velcro, everyone should go follow her and sub immediately. Because uh, she has been really killing it in the re-debut department. Though I'm pretty sure that like all of my viewers already know Val. <laughs> but might as well pl plug in Best Burb. If I have the opportunity to. Ah, I missed that. I overshot that. Which also... Very, very excited for the return of Velcro Crow. Oh no, it's raining. Very excited. Yeah. And of course, since I'm I'm pretty much leveled up on my alt, so I could probably help her a little bit because, like, technically, te technically, you have the helping fates the 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 trusts they're the trusts not the fates technically there's trust now but they aren't they're very slow <laughs> they are extremely slow like i would just like pick up the pace guys please i've done this so much faster with even with the uh, including if you, if you include DPS queue, I've done this way faster. Just waiting in queue and doing it with a group of people than doing it with trust. It's so slow. Because they don't, don't, they also don't use their job stones. I, why did I walk off of that? They, they don't use their job stones at all. So like, I was, I decided to do, I think, Garuda with, um, the trust party just like see how it was but none of them had their job stones and it was like a level 40 thing and i was like why we got this oh thank you Seishi.
Yo, thank, thank you. With the power of Seishi, we will win this. We will do this by the time we're done with stream, probably. That's a very big probably. But our chances are now increased with the power of Seishi. Okay. I gotta wait for my sprint to go off. Okay. Ah! Ah, I overcorrected. I thought I was gonna... I thought I was gonna fall off, but I was not. There's probably nothing up there, but we're gonna find out if that's true or not. Yeah, this sure is the difficult course. I really love how Yoshi, like, the Final Fantasy XIV devs really know that this game really sucks with jump puzzles and yet they plan this around it. Ah. Oh my god. <laughs> Sorry. Let me read a, a passage from, uh... Let me read a passage from my chat right now, because the top of this is the tower, and someone just wrote, Be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid or terrified because of them, for for the tower goes with you. It will never leave you nor forsake you. <laughs> I think I think Leviathan's going crazy right now. The tower is our refuge and strength, the ever-present help in trouble. <laughs> if you fall off the tower because of rain, you can't sue. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> In the tower's name we pray. Alright. That's that's what we're going with today, I guess. Shit. Run! I hope Yoshi P gives me financial compensation for all this hardship I'm going through right now in the form of a Leoford uh, minion, please. That's what I would like. Should have just ran for it. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna go up the actual jumping thing. Like the bomb route is faster if you don't get smashed off, but eh, I'm not getting too much good luck in there. Well, I'm also not having too much luck here either. <laughs> Just a random cushion here. Like, that's a minion, but like, why is it here? <laughs> There's no name on it either. 
Someone left their their cushion here. What the fuck? Is anyone in chat playing that uh, new fangled game that everyone's into? That everyone's streaming right now? Uh, what is it? The Tower of Fantasy? How's everyone enjoying that? I played a little bit of it last night, which I played with a controller and uh, controller support not good right now. Um, but I'm gonna have to, I got to restart some of my progress. It seemed pretty good. It's just that I can't I can't uh, play a lot of it. I, I can't play it to its full extent right now. Let's just say that. Because I am a weakling. The controller support. <laughs> yeah, it's it's a joke. <laughs> like, uh... There's, like... They made an attempt at putting the buttons where they are like on the main screen, but all of the tutorial had still had keyboard buttons and one of the mo one of the important moves that you can do does not even have a controller mapping it's so bad what <laughs> I'm playing Final Fantasy with the, with the controller This is why I never get to control a laptop keyboard all the way, baby. <laughs> hey, Nugget, how you doing? Hope you're having a fantastic one. Ah! We're trying and failing to do jump puzzles. Specifically, only one jump puzzle <laughs> in Final Fantasy. Hope you're having a fantastic Friday morning. Oh, you're almost getting there. Just today and another day left and you're out for your day off. It's fine. It's fine. Ah! Oh. No longer feel dead from booster, so I'm pumped to get back to work. Yeah! Awesome! You defeated the booster! Congratulations! I'm glad you're feeling better. And good on you for getting your next booster. Do this the whole time? Okay. I didn't realize I could do this the whole time. Ah! Ah! I didn't realize I could skip that. Okay. Well, that that uh, shaves off some time, I guess. Okay, so I don't need sprint, really. What's that look for, Nugget? <laughs> I never said it was a smart virus. I am a virus, not a smart virus. Ah. At least I don't have to go to the bomb area again. Perfect. Really? Okay. It's fine.
Okay. Well, now that I've learned the shortcut, it's time to be really stupid. Go stupid, go crazy, everyone. Was someone, like, was someone on social media, like, insulting Kugane Tower or something? Because this feels cruel. This feels like someone was insulting, like, Kugane Tower, like, oh, this jump is puzzling shit. Then Yoshi P would just, like, bet. Because <laughs> I feel like this is revenge for something that I don't know the context of. They're just like, well, you want your hard shit? Here's your hard shit. And whoever did that, I don't like you anymore. Because <laughs> I spent an entire week doing Kugane Tower. And... I'm afraid of what how long this will take me. Well, actually two weeks if you count my second climb up. Because... Mm. I have PTSD from that. Okay. I do need to get on my Nur alt and do the event so I can have like a cute swimsuit for Nur. But uh, <laughs> that depends how how far we get in this one. Ah, I was careful. I was too careful. I was too careful. Fine too. Have you ever been stuck in the summer jump puzzles? If you if so, you may be entitled to financial compensation. I would like some financial compensation over this. So I'm pretty sure there's a little bit of time as well. I just want to say the the mood of the room I'm in right now is like the the vibes. The vibes that we're in right now. It's really like two whole different sides of the spectrum because I am I am molding over this but right across the room from me my partner is playing stray and being cute little kitty cat <laughs> so needless to say very conflicting vibes right now <laughs> in this room Know anyone who has actually climbed this tower? Do, do the people on top of the tower even exist? Do they even exist at this point? Or are they just a concept of our imagination? Like our hopes and dreams. It's the it's the green light in Great Gatsby. 
It's just the illusion. It's an illusion. It's all an illusion. Probably not. Exactly. It's it's the Great Gatsby green light. It's it's an illusion. It's us yearning for the American dream or some shit. I love the old Gatsby movie. <laughs> the black and white one. I've never seen the old Gatsby movie. I've only seen the newer one. With like the weird uh, Moulin Rouge like making modern songs into like old timey shit. That that one. I liked it. I love Spider Man. That movie. Black and white one. Yeah, I should probably, I should probably watch it. Great Gatsby was like one of the only high school books that I enjoyed. It's a very like old book attached to stuff. Ah, okay, I get what you're saying. That that's a very pronounced style, artsy. Yes. I mean, generally, like the old black and white films are very like it's, it's theater. I wouldn't consider it like them. It was back when they're still just like doing theater style stuff in a. Uh, well, only like recorded. Lots of like very dramatic performances there. Macbeth movie I watched that the X Man dude is pretty good too. <laughs> what? There was an X Man <laughs> one? Oh my god, you got an Azza. You got several Azzas. You got at least like five of their clones. So many Azzas. <laughs> I should make that bigger. For some reason, it like made it a lot smaller than my other pop-ups when they're like the same size. I don't know why. I don't know why the Ozzas are showing up so small. That's probably there's another one that's like of similar size to Ozzas, which I might also need to adjust. It hasn't popped up yet though. That's a surprise. Patrick Stewart in his 2010. Oh, oh, oh! Now, now I know what you're talking about. I think it's a good movie. Yeah. I've never watched it, but I heard I heard good things about it. <laughs> Sorry, I'm also reading the uh, the Final Fantasy XIV chat that I've covered up, and someone just said, remember, if you're male and you go shirtless, you get a 20% accuracy buff to chumping. <laughs> it's probably very stage play. Yeah. Sometimes the best movies are just like, they feel like recorded stage plays. Or it'll have that old movie vibe where it's just like, they, they literally just had theater actors acting in front of a camera. Man, I, I want to watch some older movies. Like, I, um, like, my, my mom really likes, uh, really old-timey movies. Like, that's her favorite shit, is, like, watching movies from, like, the 30s or something. So I've watched a lot, like, through her. And there's a lot that I really, really enjoy. So I've been meaning to rewatch some of those. Like, uh, there's Gla Gaslight's a very classic one, not the first one. There was like a 20s version and a 30s version. I like the 30s version. Um, it's the one I've seen. Um, it's also a movie called The Heiress, which is very, very good. Which I think is an adaption of a, of a stage play, which was like common back in the day. Because they're like, hey, we have the stage play, let's record it. Like only in the famous, like the new fangled motion picture style. <laughs> we can have sets. And of course, some 80s movies too. I, I, my movie taste has been like, my movie taste is like surprisingly very old, <laughs> for some reason. It's it's either like you either get old shit or anime, and that's my two modes of movie. Or or the fucking Alice in Wonderland Burton movies. That's that's my taste in movies. Just old anime or Tim Burton's Alice in Wonderland. That's it. <laughs> Do 
There's no in between. Uh, for some reason, I'm getting like locked up in that point specifically. I keep missing that jump. It's like I forgot to make a two jump or something. But if you ever want a recommendation for a really old movie that's really good, um, Gaslight from the 1930s, I highly recommend. It's also very memeable, which I'm surprised people have not come back and memed the shit out of it. Because <laughs> it kind of became a meme between like me and a couple of my family members. Because it's it just like so overdramatic and so stage play that it's just like you can't not like get a little chuckle out of it. And it's also a really, really good story, too. Like, obviously, like, it's where the term gaslighting came from. So, it, it's a good story. But also, very much that old, old Hollywood style, like, so much drama. No such thing as subtlety at all. Okay, let's try not to fuck this up. Let's try. Okay, I fucked up the first jump. Let, let's go! <laughs> By the way, if anyone with if anyone wants to fucking suffer with me, I'm in Primal Leviathan. Or you could just like watch and see see me fail in real time. You don't need a Twitch delay, you can just watch me fall and then see me suffer on, on stream like two seconds afterwards. That's the real fixive experience here. Alright, there we go. There we go. All right, finally, we're back up here. Okay, let's go. Dang it. Oh my god, people are cheating to get up here. Oh! I'm not a blue mage! No! I can't do the cheating! No! No! Quick, I need PvP right now so someone can, like, fucking... Yeah, dang it, blue mages, exactly. They, they really win at everything, don't they? <laughs> Okay. They get they can even like flub the fucking Kugane Tower not not the Kugane Tower. The fucking uh lantern at the Kugane. Like they could just fucking die and a summoner on top of the ta uh, the lantern you could just fucking get them up there. Dang it, blue mages. All right, guys. New strategy. We're going to get to level. We're going to get to level eighty, blue mage. <laughs> now, someone else start jumping, and I'll get there in like an hour <laughs> or something. I don't know how to. I don't even know anything about blue mages anymore. I unlocked it, then never touched it again. 
I'm like a level one blue mage. I think I sold all the equipment. I'm so bad. Let's go. I just want... Okay, I need to wait for all these people to, like, jump off after me. Because otherwise I can't line up my... Attempt to line up my shot. There we go. There we go. Cool. Ah, that was too... That was too little. At least I have my emotional support he and minion with me. That, that's one grace we have in this cold, unforgiving world that Yoshi P has crafted for us. They won't give me a fucking uh, Leoford. Still can't figure out exactly how I line it up. It's just like sometimes I get it, sometimes I don't. I think I need to just, like aim for the a little a little after the corner. That probably made no sense to anyone listening, but I'm gonna aim for the corner. Oh, some someone's about to reach it. Are they cosplaying as Yuffie? They're totally cosplaying as Yuffie. Oh, that's cute! That's adorable! Yuffie from uh, Final Fantasy VII V. If Yuffie can do this, so can we. Let's go. There we go. Cool. You know, I was thinking, like, I kind of, I kind of, at one point, want to stream the original Final Fantasy VII. But also, I'm like, if I stream Final Fantasy VII, I'm going to fuck up the Yuffie encounter so bad. Because I always do it in every single playthrough I do. So I need to, like, have a guide with me of, like, things that I can't do when uh, talking to Yuffie. Like, no opening the menu, no doing this, don't select this, or else you don't get your Yuffie. So I always did that as a kid and I never remembered what to do. Then Vincent, I barely, I barely remember Vincent. <laughs> Except in Dirge of Cerberus. I don't remember him in the actual game, I just remember him in Dirge of Cerberus and Advent Children. God, I, um, I was stuck on Final Fantasy for seven for a while, and I've said this, I've talked about this before in stream, but like I got to was like a certain point in the game, I didn't know how to get past it, so I would just like wouldn't play it, and I would just start a new game to like see if I missed something when I was just uh, not, I was not understanding something. I was like a little too young when I was playing it, but. Um, because of that, I never met Vincent for the longest time. And then Advent Children came out, and my brother, like, we watched it together. And when Vincent came on the screen, I was just like, well, who's that? I don't, I don't remember this man. Like, who is he? I know, I think I had seen Yuffie before, so I knew her, but I had no idea who Vincent was. And I was just like, who, is this a new character? And my brother just looked at me like, oh, that's Vincent. You know, so you know Vincent? I was like, no, I don't. <laughs> I never got to that part. <laughs> so yeah, my first experience with Advent Children, I didn't even know who the fuck Vincent was. Lol, Advent Children. It's a good movie, right? Like, not for the ways they intended, but it's a good movie. <laughs> is, it, is a good movie not an entertaining one? Because it is entertaining as hell. 
If we're speaking of movies to stream, that's a good movie. <laughs> it's very entertaining. Yes. God, I need to watch it again. That used that used to be like a, a tradition when I was younger to like watch it every year or so. Just because it was like that bad. <laughs> <laughs> Did not watch it because it was supposed to be cool or something. I watched it because it was funny. <laughs> Which, you know, is a, it's a feat when you got that kind of reaction out of like an angsty middle schooler. When they're just like, oh, this is funny. When it's like an edgy, like, badass movie. And I was like, haha, funny man, say mother. <laughs> At least I think it was in middle school when it came out. I don't, I don't fucking remember. Time is a lie. And also the fucking president of Shinra is like inexplicably alive. <laughs> I like that too. I like that too so much. Okay. Nope. Oh, I did not do that correctly. Oh well. You're supposed to like wall jump off of it. sounds to me that Square Enix like it's clear with Final Fantasy 14 they have very talented writers in their employ how come they never have figured out how to write a fucking movie <laughs> they've never be been able to crack the code I almost fucked that up really bad, but it's fine. We got it. Oh. Ah, I, I, uh, I didn't, I didn't, uh, I wasn't bold about that. I was a little hesitant. At least I'm- I'm not actually- I'm gonna stop what I was about to say because I was about to fucking curse myself. Never mind. I said nothing. There we go. Nice and easy. There we go. Got it. And then I lost it. Never mind. That's what happens when you have confidence. You get overconfident. Then you... Actually, not even overconfident. You're just like, I don't want to lose this. I'm going to be careful about it. But then... Being careful is your downfall. Because then you fucking fall off again. You have to do it all over again. And try not to fall off. Like I almost said there. Is that a fucking... Their free company name's KFC. Ah. Oh. KFC is here.
There was a bunch of- there was a giant aura in, the, in my way. That's why I didn't make that. I'm gonna blame it on that aura. Because he was so much bigger than me. I'm still blaming that aura even though he wasn't there anymore. <laughs> Okay, now there's a bunny in the way. I'm gonna blame him now. I'm blaming him. Alright, KFC, do your thing. Oh, he's showing off. He's a ninja. Oh, he's a ninja. He can flip flop in the in the air. I can't flip flop in the air. I have a book. If I flip flop in the air, the book would go everywhere. No, well, maybe it'd give me wings so I could just fly up to the top of the tower. Those that, that would be the that would be the day. There we go. Oh, it looks like there's like a cute little scene going on there. That's cute. Down there with the two arrows just sitting together. That's adorable. Wait, is my tea go full? Just a second. I have heartbreaking news. My tea's my tea is cold. Uh, still gonna drink it, but I'm gonna be very sad as to do it. Alright, my sad tea is done. That's what happens when you have sad tea, you miss your jumps. So never have cold sad tea, guys. Always make sure to check your tea temperature regularly and make sure that you're not letting it cool down like too much. Or else you miss your jumps on Final Fantasy XIV and never get to the top of the summer tower. It's heartbreaking. Ugh. Okay. Bop. Yeah. Okay, bop. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I'm so close to falling off. Oh. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. It's fine. It's fine. Okay, let's go. Okay, I did the same thing again. It's fine. You know, my warrior blight's a cat. Like, can she not just climb up it using her claws or something? Avetis, can you use your claws to climb up the tower for me, please? Plus. fine. You don't have to. <laughs> go now, <nerd> go. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> it's okay. Thank you, Ten Ten. I'm gonna do this. For this alright. This this is for you, Ten Ten. This is for you. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Ten Ten. <laughs> I, 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 I failed you. Okay, uh, this is actually for you, Ten Ten. This is for you. There you go. Alright, cool. Okay.
Okay. All right. So far, so good. <laughs> the ninja just uh, flipped over me and into the water. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. Thank God. Okay, cool. All right. Final boss. I mean, this is not the final boss. There's actually this shit up there, but this is just, this is the furthest I've gone so far. Okay. So I'm planning my jumps. Oh, oh my, oh my god. And we move on. So at least that's the furthest I've gone so far. So at least I've made it that far. That this is progress. We're making progress, guys. So so much progress. Okay. No. Oh. This is the this is the tale of um of how Nur broke her ankles. Progress. Yeah, exactly, Scally. Not Nur. I'm not Nur right now. It's Avetis. This is how Avetis broke her ankles. <laughs> bah. 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 Alright, Scally, this, this jump is for you. Yeah. Really? Am I not? I'm probably not far enough on the long to plank. Alright. Ah, there we go. I have to be, like, at the edge of the plank. That is useful to know! Ah, I did not. See, like that. That's that's adorable. Like, look, look at this. That's that's adorable. The games are really winning today, guys. They're being cute. I love it. Like they're in their matching stuff, and it's cute. It's the one light. That person is tiny. Which one? <laughs> Oh, this this dude, it's a Lalafell. It's fine, they're just little gremlins. No, oh, it's a companion. Oh! <laughs> I thought you were talking about the Lalafell. I mean, technically a Lalafell can, can be a companion, I guess. Ah, oh, okay. Bop. Bah! I missed that. I was not confident in my jumps. This is what happens when you're not confident in your jumps. Okay. go. Wait, what's the name? Oh. Oh, it's Bork Laser, of course. Bork Laser! I was distracted by Bork Laser. Sorry. That's why I fell. See, like, Bork Laser's back again! I'm gonna fall! Wait, rain? Never mind. <laughs> I 
I, whenever I see the name Rain and uh, the free company name Rain in Final Fantasy, I just think of the billboard. But that wasn't that wasn't in my server, so that's not it. It's not the server. It's not the it's not the billboard people. bombs down there. So many. I, why did I jump like that? Anyway, um, here, here's the plan. Um, here's the plan. Um, someone, uh, summons Emmett Selk. And that's the plan. <laughs> there is no step two. Someone summons Emmett Silk. I need him. That, that's the plan. Guys, that's your mission. Help me get up the tower by summoning Emmett Silk. <laughs> he wouldn't help me, but it'd be nice. <laughs> it would be nice if he was here. He's just a little dude. All right, new plan, new plan. Um, so, okay, someone get Emmett Selk. Like, that's first step. Um, uh, second step. Um, activate, uh, PvP. Just activate it. I, I don't care if it's not, you can't do it on world maps, but activate it. Murder me, and then have someone heal me. That, that, that is the plan. So basically, um, I want you to murder me and then teleport me up. That that's 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 the plan. And also Emmett <laughs> and also Emmett Silk is there. <laughs> it is it is your guys' one mission. got a missing cat case on the loose. Our cat was sleeping very nicely in his bed. I Why did I just run off of that? I'm distracted. But now he's gone. He's probably upstairs eating. But I don't want to kill you, the great and lovely Nur. But consider this, Scully. I will get better. If you murder me, I'll, I'll just get better. Because someone will heal me up here and then resurrect me from the dead. So you don't have to feel bad. D don't feel bad about murdering me. But you you need to you need to personally make the killing blow, Scully. It is your own mission. <laughs> I'll get better, don't worry. Personally, me. Yes, you personally. But also, Emmett Silk has to be there. He has to. Don't ask me how he's relevant to the whole, like, murdering and resurrecting. He's just there. He's my emotional support uh, Final Fantasy villain. Alternatively, um, a, a different strategy we can go on is that, um, step one, um, I fucking die. Step, step one, I fucking die. Uh, step two, Leoford comes, then I will just resurrect myself, 
But then I'll still be at the bottom of the tower and nothing will happen. But I will be very happy. Yeah. <laughs> uh, the presence of Leoford Mist uh, has curative powers. That's a, that's a, a fact. That's a fact. Certified fact. It's it's lore. It's lore. Mm-hmm. Yeah? Y you you taking notes over there, Ten Ten? I hope you are. This will be this will be uh, uh on on the quiz. <laughs> I'm going fucking insane right now. Ah, Okay, uh, pop quiz, uh, 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 pop quiz. Uh, pop, pop quiz. Uh, <laughs> I keep trying to think of the questions for you on here because I can't think of anything. Crap, there's a quiz I need to write this crap down. Exactly. Okay, you'll be quizzed on this, uh, now, if I can think of a question. Uh. But it'll happen when you when you and me least expect it. Oh, there's there's Lawrence. Uh. Oh, speaking of Lawrence, uh, he had his first day outside today. Uh, pop quiz, uh, pop quiz, pop quiz. <laughs> yeah, take notes, take notes. You'll you'll need them for later. Uh, but. Uh, we're trying- we're gonna- we're harness training Lawrence. So he can, like, go outside and stuff. But, like, in a- in a- in a, like, leash capacity, of course. We're not just, like, letting him roam free. That's not good. But, um... But first day, he lasted five minutes until he started trying to rip and tear into the, um, harness. So, progress. It was his first day, so. But... He legitimately, like, you know in Stray at the beginning of the game where, like, the cat gets, like, latched into his harness and he just, like, flops on the ground and does, like, the belly crawl? That's exactly what Lawrence fucking did, and it was so cute. Like, like, he walked for, like, two steps, flopped down, and then what, next time he walked, he, um, he was, like, belly crawling. He'll get used to it. Just need to slowly acclimate this boy. Hi, boy. I can feel him at my feet. Here is the boy at my feet. <laughs> Hello, boy. Welcome. Oh, he's trying to climb a leg. Oh, boy. Give it a second. Boy! Hello. Are you just making your making your home down there? Okay. He's chilling underneath my blanket. There we go. Cool. What are you doing down there? Bubby? Hi! Hello! Why are you looking at me with them big old eyes? It's a Bubby! Let me... Purring. What do you have to say for yourself? He's just purring. I don't think he can hear that. He's licking my thumb. But. Okay. Good talk, Bubby. <laughs> Did you hear that wisdom? That will be on the pot quiz, by the way. <laughs> the Bubby's words of wisdom. Alright, let's continue. 
You know, it's been an hour and 44 minutes. We have, uh... We're, we're, well, we're here. Oh! oh. <laughs> I felt my li life flash before my eyes as I approached the edge. I'm glad at least we still have Bork Laser here. That this is a man that needs to be here in my trying my trying times. my emotional support Bork laser. Like nothing happened, guys. <laughs> like, like nothing happened. N no, but nothing happened. We're just starting. It is our first. Um, uh, thank you. Oh, I'm out of tea. Just a second. Uh, give, give me a second. Uh, I'm gonna get some more water. Well, get some water in general. I was drinking tea until this point. But I actually like put up a BRB screen. You get to hear the. Get to see some art. Well, you're hearing the ASMR of people getting blown up, uh, but I'll be back in like uh, two minutes and I will get some water for the care package. Alright, I'm back. So, while I'm here, I stretch. Mm. Mm. Take a sip of my new cup of water. Alright, let's go again. Welcome back. Thank you. I stretched my legs. Went to the bathroom. Uh, you know, the usual stuff. Got water. <laughs> A nice little stretch break after, uh, that. <laughs> I 
Did a cat hook onto your back? No, unfortunately not. Lawrence usually does that in the morning. Like, before I leave work, like, I'm, I'm one of those people who go into the office. So, um, usually before I leave, I, like, go see hi say hi to Lawrence before I go. Um, and whenever I go in, I, like, I'm, like, saying hi. I, uh, he eats his food while I'm in there. And then he, like, climbs on my back and sometimes sits on my shoulders. It's really, really cute. He like, eats food like really quickly though when I'm in there. I'm just like, are you okay? Are you okay? <laughs> You're not starving yourself while I'm not here. Like I know, I also know he like eats when I'm not there, but he like inhales when I'm there. It's wild. Alright, I'm gonna go at it a little bit more. I think at the two hour mark, I'm gonna switch over to my uh, alternate so I can do the. I'm gonna do the summer event on my alt and maybe attempt. <laughs> this on my ult even though it's not gonna be like maybe a change of scenery maybe like the power of my neural ult will make this uh a little easier for some reason i don't know why but that's that's the plan because i have been doing this for two hours and look where we are well almost two hours I also introduced uh, Lawrence to like a new thing today. We got him a laser pointer. <laughs> he, he really likes it. I go to sleepies now. Have a good sleep, Ten Ten. Hope everything. I hope you have a good rest of your night, a good sleep, and a good morning. Thanks for sticking around. Never mind. I want to get like a, the cute stone suit on my alt. That's kind of why I'm going more towards there now. But we will still make our attempts here. Because I do want to get to the. Before the summer event ends, I do want to get to the top of this. No! I was overconfident. It's fine. I got it. Probably. Maybe not. I don't think so. <laughs> but... Nope. This is just how it be sometimes. Life is just a giant time limited tower in the middle of Costa del Sol. And and you're just you're just a cat breaking her ankles. That's how life be sometimes. Okay, if I don't make this Next jump, I'm just gonna switch over. Indeed, yeah. Alright, I'm switching over. Alright, let me park. Let me park the cat. I'm gonna park her right here. <laughs> 
Alright. And she did. Alright. Let's log out. I gotta wait for a little bit. Sometimes you just make your cat play dead and then you log on to your other one of your many other alternate accounts. So let's head over to Aether. And let's go on my Neuralt. Nelly just recently beat uh, Praetorium, so I'm done with a Realm Reborn base content. I just have to get through um, the Astral Era quests before I get into Heaven's Ward. Then I'll be like doing, I'll be doing like uh, Final Fantasy streams a little more regularly uh, once I'm in Heaven's Ward proper. Just because I want to like share, I'm gonna I'm gonna um, relive through all the expansions, and I kind of want to take you guys with along me on the journey. Hey, Nur. hi, hi, fairy, how you doing? Hoping, hoping you're having a fantastic one. We're just switching over to my alternate account so I can do the summer event. I want to give my I want to give my cat girl um a nice swimsuit. All right, let's start this. It's convenient that I was parked here. Okay, let's uh, go over to Costa del Sol. I gotta give I gotta give my own Final Fantasy 14 character her Alright, let's get the sheep out. Sheep time. I have a sheep. Ninja Warriors back, baby. The issue with uh, Nurs as a concept. Uh, it <laughs> <laughs> the issue with like Nur and Final Fantasy is I don't have as many dies as I do on a, on Avetus, so I'd have I have to be a little more choosy with how I how I color my swimsuit. Now we go across Dinja Warrior. We have to comfort him. Alright, so let's go. Time for Ninja Warrior. Lost an ninja warrior.
It's fine, I get another try. Did it. We did it! Yay! Congratulations, Ninja Warrior. And now I'm technically done uh, with the quest, but I will take a little attempt on my alt mail. <laughs> and we're down <laughs> already. That, that doesn't count. Someone healed me, so I have to go up. I can't use that right now. That's that's why I didn't think that was a thing because like he wasn't doing anything before. But sorry, sneezed. Going up, I'm going up here. We did it. Now let's uh, attempt this. Dang it. I'm just gonna swim back. Because once I complete that part of it, I can have the shortcut to get back up. Once I complete this quest, I mean. <laughs> you got a Val! Everyone subscribe to Velka right now. She is doing a, uh, a sub thing. A month long sub thing. If you sub, she's gonna. I've gotten a bell. Yeah! I think the next incentive for her is like. I forget. I know one of them's like an Amori playthrough, which I also really, really want to see. I know the last one's song cover. Like, let's, let's do that. <laughs> Alright, got my stuff. Got my glams. Perfect. Make it a couple attempts on this account. And see how far we go on, on Nur. Here we go. Yeah. 
Back up there. Ah, your PC Streeland. is absolutely fucked. Thank you so much for the Goodbye. raid. How is your stream becoming pieces? Oh, uh? oh, uh? that seems. But hi, Streeland. How how is your stream? Thank you so much for raiding. You're playing Genshin. Hi, Lisa Jenkins. Hi, Oblivious Legionnaire. Welcome in. Thank you for joining in. Uh, for those. For those of you joining in, um, my name is Neurosis. I am a computer virus PNG tuber. And we're currently doing jump puzzles in Final Fantasy XIV. Nine hour stream from Cre Holy shit, you're playing it on your phone? Oh my god. Awesome, congrats on the nine on the nine hour stream. Longer streams are always like a thing for a lot of people. So I'm glad you made it through it in one piece, hope hopefully. And hope your phone can have like a nice rest afterwards <laughs> maybe phone is crying oh no kaze also hi wel welcome welcome in kaze how you doing hope everything fantastic one yeah phone needs a, a real vacation after a nine hour stream on genshin of all things <laughs> the phone was dying <laughs> quick like give give it something uh i fell off it's fine yeah, I can't imagine playing Genshin on the phone after the phone. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I doing great play Tower Fantasy then so like ooh, fun. Are are you enjoying Tower Fantasy? It's the one that everyone's playing. because uh, it's the new shiny thing. I hope you uh, at least I hope you enjoyed what you played of it before switching over. Texture stock glitching out. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> Lots of texture glitches. Ah. It's okay. Yeah, that's that's kind of what I heard. Like, they were hyping it up to be like the Genshin killer, but it's like, uh, unless you have a huge budget, you're not gonna you're not gonna do that, friend. Come and see. Didn't seem as fluid as Genshin, but the change was nice. Yeah, like it's always nice to have like something a little different in the market rather than like just Genshin or just something. It, it makes it like a little more spicier, a little better. I'm gonna sleep now. Have a great day. Yeah, thank you so much for the raid, Stray. Uh, de definitely uh, have a good rest after a long nine hour stream, and definitely uh, rest your phone. Make sure your phone gets some rest as well, because it is probably screaming right now. Take care, though. It's not there yet in my region. Oh no! I'm guessing it just released for North America then. <laughs> I don't know, like, I literally just heard about this game yesterday. <laughs> like, um, I was watching uh, Velcro stream, and then suddenly a lot of people were like, "Are you gonna, are, are you gonna play Tower Fantasy?" I'm like, I've never heard of that in my life. What is a Tower Fantasy? And I played a little bit of it last night. I'm planning on playing a little bit of it tonight, like not on stream, but uh, I'm gonna try and do a little bit more. It's available worldwide, just not available on Steam. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So it's just like its own thing. Kind of, I, mean, I think kind of like Genshin. Because Genshin isn't on Steam yet, right? You have to like actually get it from MiHoYo. But, um... Yeah. So, so I... So, uh, little backstory. I, I can only really play games on controller. Just because, like, I was a console gamer growing up, so I can't wrap my head around keyboard controls at all. And, uh, 
the key the controller support for uh, Tower of Fantasy very bad. <laughs> it is it is uh, horrible controller support. Not the place it's still coming soon. Status on Epic. Okay, on Steam and Epic. Not PlayStation Store for us. Get game from the official website. Oh, I never realized Genshin was in the. I never realized Genshin was in the Epic Store. I mean, I don't. I don't use the Epic Store, <laughs> so I wouldn't even know. That's interesting. For some reason, I always think Genshin is its own little entity rather than available on things. Never tried Final Fantasy XIV with the controller. Yeah, like, it actually works pretty well. Um, like, I can set up things, like, pretty easily from a controller. It, le it allows you to, like, switch over really quickly for, like, different movesets. Like, I have a set for my um, single target stuff and a set for my uh, multi target. I accidentally fell off of that. But anyway, uh, pretty much. Um, from what I can understand, it's very doable on DPS and tank, but not so well on healer. On healer, it's a little more jankier. About using the game with the camera. Understandable. Because, like, keyboard and mouse, it's like, you use the mouse for your camera. It's like, for controller, it's always joystick. Which, if you've only done it the, can, the mouse keyboard way, I can understand that. Because I have the same kind of thing with, um opposite way so opposite of your problem where it's like if I if I move my mouse and my camera moves I get really confused <laughs> is this Final Fantasy 14 version of Doodle Jump <laughs> maybe probably it probably is I mean like we're sh we sure are jumping and I feel like a doodle so I think yes I'm not- I'm not having a lot of success on the Nur alt. So, uh... What are you guys doing? You get something for getting up there? Um, it's mainly for pr Um, I actually don't know, actually. Uh... It's like the newest jump puzzle in Final Fantasy XIV. And I think... It's either bragging rights or like something very minimal that you get from being up there, but I want to do it. If I see a jump puzzle in Final Fantasy, I want to complete it. That's just how I am. It is my moral my moral failing as a person is wanting to do jump puzzles. Sense of pride and achievement. That's probably it. But this is a new summer event for Final Fantasy XIV where there's a secret jump puzzle at the end of it. I suck at these. Yeah. I am terrible at the Final Fantasy XIV jump puzzles. I think they're fun, but this is like... This is almost like irritating, <laughs> to be honest. Even though I've been doing this for like 2 hours and 12 minutes, give or take. I was doing this on my other account before switching over to this one. I believe in your- Hey Val, how you doing? Hope you're making a fantastic one. If Vel believes in me, Vel, Vel, this attempt is for you. This attempt is all for you. This is for Vel, everyone. I got all morning, Malay. <laughs> I let Vel down. I'm so sorry, Vel. <laughs> no! No! That was for Vel and I messed it up! I'm so embarrassed. I like how the the mood the nugget setting right now is just like a dance for, dance for me clown. I have all morning and entertain me. Entertain me, you little peon. Fall down the fall down the stairs again, why don't you? <laughs> this this attempt's actually for you, Bell. This whole attempt is in your name. Yeah. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> I 
Okay, let's let's do this again. By the way, if anyone's on a uh, Aether Midgard somewhere, this is where I'm doing this. If you guys want to like see me fall in real time, that's where I am. Like that, you could have seen that like two seconds earlier than you would have a stream if you were here. I should probably. Sw I after this attempt, if I don't get too far, I'm gonna. Antivirus oh. alert. So your oh. PC oh. is absolutely fucked. Hi, Good another luck. raid. Hello. Ah, Sorrel Souffle, thank you so much for the raid. Ah, let me do sh shout shout out. Ah. ah, thank you so much for the raid. How was War Thunder? Uh, for those of you coming in, I am um, Neurosis. I am a computer virus PNG tuber, and we're currently uh, doing jump puzzles in Final Fantasy XIV. And as you can see, that I've been out at this for two hours. I'm not. I'm sure. I'm. I'm. I'm doing it. <laughs> sure, I'm doing it. But yeah. Welcome. Welcome. Hope. Hope everyone. Hope everyone had a good. Uh, Good uh, time in Sorel's uh, thing. Stream. That that's what I wanted to say. I wanted to say stream. <laughs> she is a cute virus. Nope. Don't spread false information to any new chatters, Scully. I am a deadly virus. Deadly computer virus. That that's what I am. There is no such thing as cute in this in this chat. Cute cute is not a word here. That I ate it out of the dictionary. It is um, not a thing. Yeah, Sorrel's really cool. Uh, I I saw them do a thing at Oticon. They're very cool. So give them a follow if you. Uh... I can't talk and, and jump at the same time. <laughs> Ah! Cute deadly virus. Nope. Scratch the first word. That first description. Scratch that from the record. Please. It's deadly. Ah! Okay. Let's go. You may be different from the. I have a physical copy right here. That's an outdated copy, Scully. You need to upgrade it. If you fail this attempt, can the next be attempt be for Nugget? Okay, Nugget. This attempt is for you. This is, this is all for you, Nugget. Watch me carefully. I'm going to do my best for the Nugget Nugget Bear. I gotta focus. It's for Nugget. Better one. Oh. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Look at has a gun pointed at me. No. That was my practice attempt. That was my practice attempt. <laughs> that was a practice round. Okay. This is actually the real attempt. This is the real attempt for Nugget. Come on. Uh. Okay. Real. Real. One hundred percent real. Intentionally failing? No! That was my practice round! Nugget! It was a practice round. It was a practice round. Like, here we go. Here we go. I needed to practice for this, because I never want to fail you, ever. Ah. That was also a practice attempt! That was also practice! That was also practice. Don't, don't, um, don't do anything. Don't look at me. Do not look at me. I do not perceive me. I'm here. There we go. There we go. We're just getting to a rhythm here. There we go. 
that was also... <laughs> Let, let's just uh, set the record straight that uh, every single attempt I make here is a practice round. There's no such thing as a real round here. It's fine. It's fine. Nugget, don't look. <laughs> Thank god I noticed this guy. They didn't even point it out that like, hey, you can use this dude to teleport. <sighs> After this uh, practice attempt, um, I'm gonna probably go put... Okay, we're going to Limsa. I want to put on my uh, new glam. Wait a minute, do I... I don't think I have, uh, I don't have, think I have glam stuff. I'll need to buy some. I remember last time I did glams and, uh, like, last time I was on this. Here I lie, with broken ankles while doing a dive. Sad because my streamer doesn't value my life. No! No, Nugget! <laughs> no, Nugget! <laughs> no! I'm doing my best. <laughs> I I I want to save you, JK. I hope so. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna get some Snow White dye. I think that'd be that looks sick. Now you like not have 99. Let's get this much. I think I also want like some yellow, or am. <gasps> <laughs> it's just nugget that looks like you're threatening me. Are you threatening me right now? Are you doing a threatened? Are you doing a threat? <laughs> nugget would never. Yeah, I, but why was the gun out? That's the thing. Like you had your gun out. Why did you do that? <laughs> I don't know, I'm getting a little bit of a sussy vibe over there. Yeah, I'll get one of these. All these, all these metallic dyes are so expansive. I don't think, I don't think any of the metallic dyes looks that good in the game. Anyway, let me get some. Where do I get uh, glam stuff? Well, it's not there. Catalyst? That's not. Oh, there it is. Glaber Prism. Uh, I don't need that many. Probably. I'm probably gonna get more glams later in the online. Nugget can throw a whole 180 of emotions at person to distract them. For you see, Nugget is an apex predator, and this is how they hunt. Perfect. Scully about to write a entire documentary about the Nugget Nugget Bear. That's his title. Is the bear. <laughs> we're, we're gonna observe. Kep wait. Kepka's favorite. Sir, can you explain your name, please? Please? I will do it too. Yes, I I require a full documentary. You know how VTubers do like a whole um, VTubers do like a whole debut thing, 
Um, my debut is actually just going to be a, a formal showing of Scully's documentary on the Nugget Nugget Bear. <laughs> It'll have nothing to do with me at all. It's just a documentary. The world premiere. Don't say so in innocent, innocent. Are you though? I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm getting some vibes over there. Not quite. I'm not quite. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, let's go. Only- oh, I- it's not- why are you doubting me? I don't know, it's just that I'm getting a feeling in my bones. It's just a funny little feeling that I'm having. Hmm. I've never been unsafe in my life. Have you though? I have to wait- I actually have to wait for the documentary. I need to like see all the sides of this. In the documentary, specifically. Alright, let's- let's get dressed. It's beach time! It's beach season! I don't like that. <laughs> My eyes! Yeah, it's beach season. <laughs> My cat is in a little shoebox. It is very, very cute. Huh? He just, like, in. Oh, he just walked into it? Yeah, yeah. Ah, my young and innocent mind. I mean, Nugget, this is a mature stream. I mark my, my streams as mature. <laughs> Didn't you get the notification when, like, the first time you walked in? However long ago it's been? Uh... Do I like that flower on with this outfit? Alright. The Nugget Nugget Bear has no set habitat, for they are no, a nomadic hunter. They join into new regions, streams, where they settle down for a bit, waiting for an unsuspected prey, streamer, comes to meet them. This is only a taste of the documentary. Perfect! I have been soiled by cat girl changing clothes. I can never find a husband now. <laughs> it's it's a dragon girl, lizard girl specifically. She's a lizard. <laughs> I I fucking love that, Scully. Please, I I can't wait for to see more of the documentary. Uh, I'm trying to decide on a on a on a flower for. I'll just do this. This this is a classic. Uh, or maybe I should change it up because it's sort of summer. These are cherry blossoms, but those are. Can I find a streamer? I. <laughs> I. What is that email? Let, let me highlight this. Just a second. You nom. Jokes on you, motherfucker! I don't have feet. <laughs> Half my legs disappear. <laughs> J what? Hey, Nugget, what are you getting here? I don't have any legs. <laughs> what exactly are you grabbing onto? I don't have these. <laughs> My legs are gone. <laughs> Can't believe this shit. <laughs> what are you grabbing onto? <laughs> the streamer, no feet. <laughs> so, no feet. Smash his phone. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, thank you. I'll send you both the rough draft first draft soon. Thank you, Scully. I appreciate it. <laughs> yeah, I think I could get do the lily of <laughs> culture DXE not found. <laughs> Cause I don't have legs. <laughs> Yeah, I like- I still like the- this. 
isms. <laughs> the cultured. Cultured isms. Anyway, let's color let's color this swimsuit. This whole situation has been a moment and a funny one. <laughs> it sure has. This is this is what my brain is like on jump puzzles. Especially ones I can't finish. Uh, how? I don't have much die selection on this one. I don't have much to go on. I like that. I'm in shambles, Scully. Why are you laughing at my torment? <laughs> Be because you don't. Because your streamer doesn't have feet? Look at it. <laughs> Alright. I'm. I am SMH shake in my head. SMH my head. As the cool kids have been saying recently. My streamer has been playing DDR with her hands this whole time. I mean, I've said that. I've said that multiple times so far, Nugget. I play DDR on a handstand. I don't have feet. <laughs> That's how it would be. I'm really, really the National Geographic team who's watching all this and must not interfere. <laughs> oh my god, you're like, <laughs> you're you're peering out at us with binoculars. Eh, I think I like the purple. I think the purple looks nice on her. I think it's some purple, purple swimsuit. I think that looks nice. Like the the yellow, the purple, the blue. Oh, sorry, camera crew. Now watch me do a flip. <laughs> oh, Zarak! Hello! Welcome in! Hope you're having a fantastic uh, morning, afternoon, or evening, depending on where you are. <laughs> Those are some really impressive flips, Nugget. I'm very proud of you. Uh. Oh, oh yeah. Feet. Hello, Nair. I'm doing good. How are you? I'm doing pretty pretty good. Um, my brain is slowly melting out of my body because I failed at jump puzzles for uh, two and a half hours. Yeah, you wanted to, Sarah. <laughs> I'm like a guy in a bush with the binocular and three cameras just staring at you do flips. <laughs> and they're saying, nice, 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 nice. Did you already steal my feet and then return that? Nugget? Did you steal Xerox's feet? Did, did you steal his feet? How dare you? <laughs> Alright, I think this looks nice. Like, the straps, uh, it doesn't add too much color, but it, like, does something. I had a good time. <gasps> I'm not even gonna read that nugget. What the fuck? What the fuck? Barred them for a marathon in the mountains? Hello? <laughs> <laughs> I see now it's time for me to be like shocked by my chat at all times. Let's just get some like bright yellow in here. Oh, that look that looks nice. That looks like more of a gold than it was before. <laughs> yeah, uh if you didn't hear that, my partner just said that Nugget is in the same camp as uh my cat. My cat is also a footman. The nugget is breaking there. <laughs> like, to be honest, to be completely honest, every single time I stream Final Fantasy XIV, chat breaks me in some way. <laughs> like, for some reason, that this specifically is the game where people where chat decides to wild it. I don't know why. Got almost disqualified by dis dis disputed that nowhere in the rules did it ever say that participants had to be bipedal beings, so I joined as a quadruped. <laughs> so you're galloping, <laughs> nugget galloping for towards the finish line. There, we there we go. Now I am dressed. Some Zootner. Final Fantasy Edition. Heck yeah. 
I was yee-hawing that shit the whole way. <laughs> centaur nugget. Can't believe that we've been talking to a centaur this whole time. You, you know, anything could be on in your, the internet. They look like. Mm. Does this look like the face of a cutie to you? That is pure deadliness. She's gonna murder you with this book. <laughs> it was horrifying. I don't know where you got the other legs from. Sips. My partner could compare Nugget to a cat. Spits drink out. <laughs> I don't have a spit emote. Ah, oh, shit. I should get a spit emote. <laughs> Ren! Quick, I, I'm writing my my uh, my DM to Ren right now. Like, I need scratch all of our, our uh, current plans. I need to spit emote. <laughs> okay. I I just had a thought of what I was gonna do, and then I forgot. I'm gonna do gold saucer. Wait, wait a minute. I have to teleport to Gold Saucer. I have to go to Ulda. I'm gonna do Gold Saucer stuff. At least I'm as cute as Lawrence. Yeah! That is a very high, high mark to make because Lawrence is very, very cute. While Ren is on break, just chilling somewhere, her phone starts to blow up and it just text DMs emails from Nur asking her to scrap everything to make a spit emote. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I am... I am... I am living in Ren's DMs right now. <laughs> they expect you to agree with everything. Thanks. Nugget is the cutest one. Nugget is THE Nugget Nugget Bear for a reason. Ren! Ren, I would like a spit emote, please. That's what I need. I need more animated emotes to begin with. I only have the fucking Anders vibrate emote for my animated ones. I need the spit. Bwah. Animated spit emote. Okay, I can get Cacpoc tickets. I'll do that. Okay, so I need to get numbers. Uh, that's. Sorry, doing math in my head. That's 19. That's really shitty. I'm gonna do this one. Not getting the good stuff for this so far. Well, I got something. That's... At least, I got that. doing all of my gold sauce requests that I've neglected to do them before. And I'm pretty sure I would want some uh, some glams from here, so I'm just clearing this out. Hmm. 
Let's go to the place I never go. Chocobo Square. Let's bop. So I get all the aetherite so I can kind of teleport around this place as I see fit. I personally just can't wait to get to the end of A Realm of Born stuff on this account. Because then I can finally start like getting into stuff I never see, ever. I have I have so many alternate accounts, I've seen so much of A Realm of Born that I'm like, okay, I wanna I wanna see some Heaven Sword finally. Let me suffer. <laughs> go back up here. I jumped too soon. I'm a fool. Mahjong. My favorite story about Final Fantasy is like this one dude who only played Final Fantasy to play the Mahjong. Because at the time it was like the only way you could play Mahjong online. <laughs> They just got a fucking account and all, like only leveled up to like the amount you needed to get here and play Mahjong and only did that. <laughs> For some reason a lot of my uh, VTuber friends have been getting into Mahjong like really hardcore. I know nothing about it so I'm glad they're having fun. The little phone game they're playing it on looks really cute though. All the characters look really nice. Oh, I didn't get the teleport from Mahjong. I mean, they knew what they wanted to grab the opportunity. Exactly. Like, they were like, I want Mahjong, and heard that it was in Final Fantasy, and just like, okay, that's what I'm doing now. I am now a pro Mahjong player only on Final Fantasy XIV. Kind of understand why I want to be good at it. I mean, I. Like. I think as long as you're having fun, you don't have to, like, necessarily be, like, good at something. I think you're having fun playing Mahjong. That's the point of it, really. I just don't understand it at all. <laughs> so that's why I haven't gotten into it. There's so many, so many symbols. I, the only thing I know from watching Velcro do it is that um, there are 13 orphans for some reason. And... There's a dragon, I think, probably. Um, and there's anime boys, but I don't think that's like the Mahjong thing. I think that's just a, a phone game thing. But there are anime boys. Orphans. Yeah, like, there's a thing. I don't understand it. Like, there's a guy who learned the entire French dictionary and competed in the French Scrabble game and won. He didn't know how to speak French. Oh, God. I mean, if you're... If you have a dream, <laughs> you just go at it, I guess. It's more than I would usually do in a given day. But yeah, there's like a... 
I don't know if it's like a move or like a set of Mahjong tiles, but there's something called 13 orphans. And I don't know why there's 13 of them, but there's 13 orphans. <laughs> no, I landed in the wrong spot. Okay, gatekeeper. That is my entire experience with Mahjong, is just that there's orphans, there's dragons, there's anime. That's all I know. Maybe I'm really, maybe if I catch like more Mahjong streams, I'll catch up on what it does, but I don't know. <laughs> I, I wa had to watch, like, because I was in marching band, uh, 13 orphans is a hand. Ah, so you have 13 whole orphans in your hand. Ah. This is why I keep uh, my uh, Final Fantasy XIV chat covered up on stream, but I just got an advertisement for um, an 18-plus role-playing group. Ah. <laughs> Oh, oh, Final Fantasy, never change. You have 13 orphans as hands? <laughs> why do you- why- why do you have 13- why do you have the hands of 13 orphans? The slice of- oh, I like that one. I'm gonna stick around for that. Sounds like a nugget thing. To have 18 orphans as hands? Nugget. Imagine having the hands of 13 orphans. <laughs> Yay, I know what gold saucer is. Yay, let me use my voucher. Yay. Sounds like you would be a criminal. I mean, probably. <laughs> it depends on if they caught you with them. <laughs> You're not a criminal unless they, <laughs> unless they catch you with the 13 orphan hands. <laughs> Sorry, no deal in hands, only de deal in feetsies. So you'd have 13 orphan feet. See, so you'd have the feet of 13 orphans. That's what you're saying, right? Theoretically. <laughs> this is exclusively a theoretical. Uh, just for the FBI man. So the way 13 orphans work is that you need one and nine of each of the three suits, one of each of the winds and dragons, and they get, get another nine, one nine wind or dragon. Where did the orphans come in then? Is the dragon the orphan? If you promise that you won't question where I source my products, so then I will sell my words to you. Ah, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. I I have zero questions for you, Nugget. I will never question anything you do. <laughs> Unless you're asking about my own legs. Hey, I'm just waiting here for the uh, the promised time, because slices of like slices right is up, and I like I love that golden saucer game. Yeah, guessing it's called Thirteen Orphans because none of the tiles actually connect in other ways. I think. Ah, oh wait, that actually would make sense, because if they don't connect at all, then it's like they're thirteen orphans. Don't worry, I had consent when I sourced these. Hmm. So, so, so you you consensually have thirteen orphans hey, orphans feet, I guess for you. Thirteen singular title. Oh, okay. That makes sense. Sold up. Where did the dragons come from? Where they go? Where they come from? Cotton Eye Nero. 
Uh, uh. Now, now it's time for me to dance. Sorry, I, I must dance. It is my calling. <laughs> As an American. <laughs> That's the national anthem, actually. Ah, slice is right. Ah, it's a sprint there. Let's go. It's slice is right time. Yo, Jumbo. Wait, how do you dance? Didn't you say you have to eat handstands? Xerox? I do handstands. Never proceeds to do a handstand and dance. Exactly! Scully gets it. I DDR with my hands and I dance with my hands. Like, what are you not getting here? Neurons, look at you, dude! <laughs> Yes, I do. Confirmed. It's lore. It's canon now. It's lore canon. <laughs> I don't run a lot, but if I do need to run, <laughs> I run with. I run like Geo, dude. <laughs> that. That's why I have such big sleeves. My big sleeves are to hide my giant bulging muscles. <laughs> it would make everyone feel bad. That's why. They're just overall comp over overly complicated Geo dude. <laughs> yeah, that's actually um that's my mom is a Geo dude. Hide your swole ass arms. Exactly. Like, if everyone saw my swole ass arms, then everyone would feel like I don't know. They they would just be in awe. Geo Dudette. That that is true. But I gotta I gotta make it so people aren't distracted by my arms. <laughs> Otherwise you gotta just be like amazed by my pecs or not pecs, my biceps. Mom is Geo Dude, Dad is a Porygon. Uh Dad is a ditto. <laughs> Dad is Gia, bruh. Bruh. Remember, guys, um, Ditto plus Geodude equals computer virus. The math just adds up, you know. Alright, here comes your jumbo. I actually, like, look at the screen now. Uh oh. Uh oh. Listen, I failed at jump puzzles this entire time. We're gonna win at this, probably, maybe. Let's kick Yojumbo's ass. Let's go. Learned off today. Nugget is an apex predator who hunts for feet, and there is actually a geodude that. Yeah, like, you learn something new every day. It is one of the few things that you can learn in a day. W watching streams, I guess. Let's go. Okay, so I just need to park somewhere. This is all random chance, so I'm just kind of parking somewhere and waiting for my fate. 
That's gonna be my D&D character sheet. <laughs> that you're an apex predator that hunts for feet. I hope you're the villain. <laughs> no, wait, D&D, um... Cha chaotic neutral. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, are we surviving? Dang it. I chose wrong. Dang it, I fail at I fail at jump puzzles today. I fail at Yo Jumbo's challenge. Let's see if anyone survives. Got a lot of people. Usually they start dropping off at the four mark. There we go. Oh, they're they're mostly staying on. Damn, they're doing good work. A lot of winners today. Oh, awesome. Lawful evil, probably, because I force horse all my feet with full fledged consent. Hmm. Hmm. That's gonna be taking feet as trophies. Imagine. So, you know, like how there's like trophy rooms where there's a bunch of like deer heads on the wall or something. For Nugget, it's just like a foot wall. There's just gonna be feet everywhere. <laughs> it's gonna be so weird. But anyway, I think, I think, I think I'm gonna call it for today. I'm just gonna park Nur right here. I don't like this, where this, and she said it as I typed this. <laughs> it, it goes there, Scully. That's where, there, that's where it go. <laughs> But anyway, I think this is where I'm going to call it. So thank you everyone for joining me for the stream. Um, we didn't conquer the jump puzzle, but at least we got some, we got a cute swimsuit for Nur. My Nur alt. <laughs> that, that's all. Um, lovely cursed stream. Every single time I do Final Fantasy, you guys make it cursed. And I love you for it. Thank you for cursed stream. Let's see who we're going to raid. Who are we going to bring the cursed energy to today? Let me see. Uh, the raids not accurate right now. Raid target. Let me see. Who's online? Who is online? We're going to raid Fawia. Because Fawia is online. She is streaming Cult of the Lamb, which is like that new game or something? I saw it on the front page of my Steam earlier. But that's where we're going. We're going to Fawia. So everyone, um, send Faria all your love. And let's go. Let's go see Cult of the Lamb. Oh, she has a really cute like recolor of her model. Like the preview just like came up. She has like cute hair. Her hair is really cute. But yeah, let's go. Cool game, just download it. Can't wait to play it. Yeah! Can't wait to see a little bit in Faria's stuff. So anyway, uh, thank you guys so much for joining me. Um, but, see you guys next time. I'm probably gonna stream tomorrow. It's not gonna be Final Fantasy, so no curse stream tomorrow. <laughs> it's probably gonna be some, uh, probably gonna be some, like, Dragon Age or some shit. Probably, yeah, yeah, yeah. Probably gonna be Dragon Age. But, see you guys later. See Bye.